Welcome to Mainline Auto Body. We're going to update you on our quest for finding all the two second lean ideas that we can introduce. And we're in the paint shop today, and Juan has come up with the idea of aprons, pocketed aprons for material storage for the painters so that they can save steps to and from the material bin or the material cart. So let me uh, let the boys explain how it works. So I've got Steve on the left there and Juan in the middle and Sergio on the right. Juan, you came up with this idea that maybe you could pack the items that you use most frequently that were on your cart but save the steps of walking back and forth. So tell us what you discovered and what you ended up with. Well basically uh, we just wanted to come up with a way uh, to carry a lot of the materials that we use off of our cart on us all the time so we don't have to walk you know two three four or five times to our car our car could be right next to us but if we still got to get up and walk to, to the car um, we're still having to take steps to get material so basically we put as much material on us as we can without uh, without it getting too bulky too heavy um, and it's a lot of the stuff that we consistently use that we're consistently grabbing so let's take a look at the cart for a moment and see that there's an example of a typical prep cart with all the different supplies that you may carry or, with, or on the cart. So now show us, let's, let's take Steve for example. Steve, what do you have in your apron? Uh, for example, uh, let's start from the top. I have some razor blades in here. I have a sticky notepad for writing down all rows when you're mixing uh, material, writing down a paint pool. I have a pen, safety glasses, Posca pen in case you see any additional damage, it's easy to form out. Uh, I have a pair of gloves, just real quick, if you, I need to wipe the down. It needs to get painted real fast. Uh, I have 600 grit soft pads. I have a roll of inch and a half tape. Um, I also have some 400 grit soft pads. I have a red and a gray scotch bright. I have some combi putty just for fixing chips, last minute deal. I have a hair blower and I have a milk thickness gauge for just checking paint. Nice. So, okay. so you got a lot of stuff in those few yeah. little pockets. Okay, Sergio, you've implemented it as well. Are you finding some time savings? Uh, yeah, we do find it saving a lot of time because most of the stuff that we carry is what we use the most. So it's definitely helping us as far as saving time from getting up, walking to our car. It's more convenient. So if we had to guess at how much time, each time you had to walk back and forth to your cart, how many seconds would you guess that would take? Uh, between four or five seconds, so you have to get up, grab something, come back, and then that's, um, I would say, throughout the whole day, one guy could be 20 times. At least. At least. At least. Maybe more. Maybe more. And we're four guys, so it's definitely a lot of time saving. Well, I'll do the math then, and I'll try and figure it out. Gene's in the booth painting, so there's four of you at least 20 times a day at least, at least. so these aprons are going to be a huge time saver yeah, yeah? all right so juan thanks for the idea all you boys thanks for putting it into place good hustle good job so here's a recap of the savings on the painters aprons four painters who are making that trip at least 20 times a day to their cart that's 80 times times 10 seconds each time which is awfully conservative or 800 seconds 800 seconds times 252 business days, that translates to 2,001 600 seconds, divided by 3,600, that's 56 hours a year we've saved by putting on the apron. And man, I'm guessing that that is, it's probably twice that savings at the least, but this is just conservative. Good job, boys.